Today we're going to go over one of the key building blocks to a British roast dinner, potatoes. We're going to prepare our potatoes three ways. One, roast it with a crisp outside and a fluffy inside. Two, buttered with parsley. And three, a nice smooth buttery mash. Before we start we have to decide what kind of potatoes we're going to use. Some potatoes are specialist potatoes that are used for boiling or mashing or frying. Others are all-rounders like the Yukon Gold potatoes that we're going to be using today. Every British roast potato journey begins with peeling the potatoes. It's a tedious job but someone's got to do it. We then cut the potatoes into a medium size making sure to get some nice straight edges that are going to brown nicely in the roasting pan. Put the potatoes into cold salted water, bring them to the boil and cook them until they're tender but just slightly undercooked. Drain your potatoes and give them a little toss just to rough up the edges. This will help them go nice and crispy during the roast. Add some fat to your pan. Here we're using beef fat, also called dripping, and we're topping it up with a little extra oil. Once the fat is hot, add the potatoes to the pan, season with salt and pepper, spread the potatoes out, and add whatever herbs you want to use. Today we're using rosemary and thyme. Place the potatoes into a hot oven and let them roast away for around 20 minutes after which time we'll take them out and give them a turn. Return to the oven for another 20 minutes and you end up with nice crispy roast potatoes. Roast potatoes, done. Next up, buttered potatoes with parsley. Peel the potatoes and cut them in half lengthways. From here we can boil them or steam them. After about 20 or 30 minutes, a knife should go through the potatoes with ease, signaling that they are done. Place the potatoes in a bowl, season them with salt and pepper, add the butter and parsley and give them a mix. Butter potatoes, done. To end today's potato trilogy, we're going to be making a mash. Quite simply, we take peeled, cooked potatoes and mash them. You can use a traditional masher, but a potato ricer will ensure that your mashed potatoes are free of lumps. Add butter, season generously and mix until it comes together. Mashed potatoes, done. We hope you enjoyed our potato masterclass today. How do you like your potatoes? Let us know in the comments.